constellation insane gains ahead. What's going on guys, Randy here with another crypto video. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and hit the bell notification. Today I'm going to take a look at Constellation and why there are some insane gains ahead. I'm going to give you a quick rundown of what Constellation is, some things that have been going on within the community. Some of it's a little older news, but it's relevant. So if you've never heard of Constellation before, uh, this is definitely a project you want to dig a little deeper into because they have some huge things going on highly underrated and uh, you know cream does rise to the top as they say and i think this is one of those projects that is the cream that eventually will be a, a top cryptocurrency in the space now getting into what constellation is constellation network is a framework that allows everyone to build and conduct a business on the blockchain existing blockchain technology does not support the speed scalability and economic incentive needed to build applications with robust business logic, but Constellation is its own ecosystem comprising Hypergraph, a feeless network with a reputation-based consensus mechanism, the peer-to-peer -peer stargazer wallet, and a decentralized finance platform called the Lattice Exchange. Constellation's L0 state channel token standard is an evolution of smart contracts that defines the rules of any business while tapping into Constellation's hypergraph powered by rewards. So a few things to note here about Constellation. They don't use smart contracts. You have blockchains that are all about getting uh, smart contracts and trying to deploy smart contracts, but Constellation doesn't even do that. They have what are known as state channels, which is a step above smart contracts. Uh, but what are smart contracts? A smart contract is a virtual agreement in which the conditions for its execution are evaluated and confirmed by a computer code. Its key feature is trustless execution between two parties. So the next step, the evolution of smart contracts are state channels and that's what Constellation is known for. They solve this problem and leap beyond the limitations of smart contracts State channels exist on Constellation's Hypergraph Transfer Protocol, also known as HGTP, while most blockchains like BTC, ETH, ADA, or DOT are Layer 1 networks, Constellation is unique in that it's the world's first Layer 0 network. Layer 0 is the layer beneath all the other protocols and allows for unprecedented cross-chain interoperability. DAG is Constellation's token. DAG is needed for the creation of a state channel. Now a little bit on what a state channel actually is. Uh, it's an autonomous business that designs its own ecosystem on Constellation's hypergraph. The tech of the HGTP is so profound that it allows for state channels to create extraordinary use cases. State channels are able to process and validate third-party data for multiple blockchains or other data sources such as cars, devices, APIs. So think Internet of Things. This is remarkable. This is one of the main differences between Ethereum and it can't do that. For example, Ethereum smart contracts are only capable of handling specific data. On the Ethereum blockchain, this is incredibly limiting since most of the world's data is not on Ethereum. So just on August 26th, you had the US Air Force prioritize blockchain security with a new Constellation Network contract. Now this is huge, this is the US Air Force using Constellation and their high security to keep their data secure. So this agreement's a blockchain-based initiative from the US Air Force that will employ Constellation's hypergraph network to provide data security with the Department of Defense's commercial partners. In the last few years, blockchain technology has become very attractive to enterprise organizations with its promise to deliver more efficiency and security for numerous use cases, including supply chain management, said Constellation co-founder and chief strategy officer, Benjamin Diggles. This contract opens the door to bigger, more critical uses of blockchain for data protection in a global digital infrastructure, bringing forth the true promises of the core technology. That's a huge contract for Constellation, needless to say. Constellation Network announced that GeoJam is its next incubation project. GeoJam will be entering the blockchain and cryptocurrency space by integrating its existing business model on Constellation's hypergraph transfer protocol and creating its own token called Jam. And then will later be launched on Constellation Lattice Exchange Launchpad. Working with Constellation, GeoJam will merge its existing point system onto the blockchain with the creation of a cryptocurrency token 
This creates the opportunity for token holders to use JAM tokens to engage in various opportunities on the platform, meanwhile increasing revenue for feature celebrities, enabling fans with a deeper level of gamification. So now you're starting to see projects actually launching on the Constellation ecosystem. This is just the beginning. You know, another reason why I like Constellation is because their team is active. They're out there engaging with the community, they're out there talking about the project. A bear market's coming. We're going to have a bear market. And there are certain coins that you don't want to hold on to in a bear market. Constellation, I believe, is one that you want to hold for the long term. The reason why I would feel comfortable doing that is because of the type of team that's behind the project. If I can see what's going on with the company, it, 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 it's going to put me at ease. And now, if, if you look at Constellation Network's YouTube channel, they have the Hypergraph Hour episode every week. And it's going to give you information on what's going on with the project. You know, the bear market is when companies go to just rot and die because uh, they're not doing anything or they can't um, improve or succeed in their mission. And Constellation is one that I feel that is going to come through in the bear market. And, and how do I know? Because I can watch them every single week talk about their project and what's coming and what's being updated and partnerships they have uh, going on. I'm going to play a quick clip for you here from the founders of Constellation from one of their Hypergraph Hours. This is a clip that was posted by Documenting Constellation on Twitter. I just want you to hear the passion and the things that are coming from the Constellation team in the coming months. I think it's very telling on who you, who you have here as uh, leadership for this team. Mainnet 2.0 is a huge, huge, huge release. I mean, this is essentially like a restart to this entire company. It is the technology re-envisioned. It's the technology that we envisioned four years ago. This is not something that just you hit a start button and it appears. This is something that has a rolling productization. There are so many features and functionalities coming out with mainnet that that each one has its own pod, its own team that has to build out the business model around it, build out the productization. So what we're going to be showcasing at the end of September is truly the, the developer release. You're going to get first access to see us do cross-chain swaps. We're going to give you first-hand access to building a state channel and seeing it in a live environment. Um, we're also going to invite a company that's, had, that's been building their first state channel on Constellation. They're going to come in and demonstrate uh, building a state channel and what they've done to date. So you're going to see a real company actually come in uh, and show what they've been doing for the past couple of months uh, in state channel development. So Mainnet 2.0 will start at the end, of, the release will start at the end of September. It will have rolling productization coming out over several months. Uh, and you're going to see that in perpetuity. You're going to see new ways for nodes to come online and get involved as early as the beginning of October. So everything is on time. It is an absolutely amazing piece of technology that I, I'm proud to see our protocol team work uh, so diligently to do. And now inviting new product people to come in and take it to the professional level that will take on the Uniswaps, the Ethereums, the Consensus, uh, the God, you name it. Uh, we're going to do it. Um, so I'm really, really excited about that. So uh, you can stop your chatter and speculating like you heard it from our mouth. You're going to see it at the end of September with an amazing demo from Wyatt, from one of the companies building uh, the first state channel. They'll demo it, and then we'll be rolling out with ways for people uh, to get ways for people that have acquired 250,000 DAG to get involved. It's a lot to be excited about. That this is all coming to fruition as we speak here over uh, the end of September, early October, we're gonna be able to see what's going on with Constellation. And like I said, this is a project that would be worth holding on in a bear market or at very least accumulating. There were so many crap projects in 2017, top 100 projects that kind of disappeared and it was uh, a needle in a haystack trying to find the good ones to accumulate. But here, I think going into this next bear market, there's going to be a lot to choose from. And Constellation is, you know, do your own research. But in my opinion, it's going to be one of those that you want to uh, accumulate. All right, taking a look at Constellation DAG price right now, it's 30 cents per coin. Circulating supply of 2.45 billion Total supply is 3.5 billion. All time high for DAG was 45 cents just one month ago. It's down 33%. This is about the time of 
the Air Force contract announcement. And you can see, of course, announcements are going to pump things up. Buy the rumors, sell the news. But this is definitely, like I've been saying, a coin that uh, long term it's going to be, it's, it's going to pay off. Peak of this bull run, I still think it's coming more than likely at the end of the year, early next. I think the cycle is going to, going to continue on. But Constellation's a project I could see easily hitting $2 at the peak. It could go higher. It could go lower. Who knows? My guess is as good as any. I wouldn't be surprised if it if we hit $2 per DAG. Let me know down in the comments, where do you see Constellation DAG getting to? The peak of this bull run blow off top. Do you think we could hit $2? Are you expecting 5 or $10? Uh, let me know in the comments what you think about that. That's all I have for you for today. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, hit the bell notification. And if you would like more exclusive content, my crypto picks. Feel free to join my Patreon link is in the description.